Hi guys. So tonight we are going to really quickly go over um, what we do as coaches and um, what we do. I'm going to really quickly talk a little bit about my story and how coaching has changed my life. Um, how we earn money and then how to get started. These are like the biggest questions and we're busy, right? So I try to keep it to 30 minutes. Well, I will keep it to 30 minutes. And then if you have any questions, we'll answer that after. I have a three week old. So she is like kind of crying. She's cluster feeds at this time. Not a great time on my part, but I did just feed her right before we came up here. So um, that's another reason why if I, if you hear me talking fast, it's because I hear baby crying and you know that like you cannot ignore that mama, cry, that baby cry. <laughs> so that's why. Um, so for, for me, I found coaching. I was, I used to do Instagram only for giveaways. I was super broke as a joke and I loved free stuff. So I was scrolling and this girl was doing a Shakeology giveaway and I had no idea what it was, but she made this picture look delicious and it was chocolate and I love chocolate. So I entered to win. I did not win that giveaway, but I found another post that she made later. Um, <laughs> sorry. Hey Debbie, who invited you? I read it like super snobby. <laughs> Sorry, you can sit with us. Um, <laughs> squirrel, <laughs> reading the chat for anybody that's watching this recording. Um, okay, so I found coaching and I talked to my coach about it. She said, hey, are you feeling unfulfilled, underpaid, like unappreciated? Do you feel like there's, you, you were meant for more? And I just kind of was like, yeah. So I, I asked her about it for more information. She sent me one of these kind of webinars. It was a recording. It was about an hour. I watched it all. I signed up that day. I was that person. Not everybody does that. And I hopped on her team call that night and I, guys, I never looked back. So that was for me. That is not everybody's story. I, um, Jessica started as a challenger and then I heckled her. No, I was kidding. <laughs> I just kept inviting her and she just kept blowing me off and I continued to support her as a challenger, but I knew in my heart that she was going to be an amazing coach. And I, I just was like, no, I like, I know she's going to coach and I'm not going to take no for an answer. So I'll just check in every month. Not an obnoxious, but I I'm just myself. And I would even be like, call her out. I would be like, okay, I'm sending smoke signals because you've ignored me for two weeks. <laughs> so, um, you know, um, that's what I really love about this is that it's, you know, you can, maybe you're starting as a challenger, maybe you're starting fresh with, you know, no experience from Beachbody. There's some, there's no wrong way to do coaching. Um, but the best part is, is that you're going to get discount on awesome products and then you're going to have even more of a supportive community. So I found coaching when I had three jobs, I actually like literally would pack every single meal because I also had $7 in my bank account the night, the day that I signed up to coach. I was constantly paycheck to paycheck. I knew I had a student loan payment that was coming out the next day. I knew that my bank was going to overdraw. I was like a regular member of the insufficient funds club, like call the bank, see if I can get that $30 fee waived. That was my life every week. And so I just decided like, what do I have to lose? So I put on the credit card, um, which also scared me because I had almost $80,000 in debt from, you know, at that point. And I thought, oh my gosh, I don't want to put more on, but I have nowhere to go but up. So for me, I do have my uh, master's in clinical exercise physiology. So I was doing like corporate wellness, personal training, teaching fitness classes, and then also serving. You do not need any type of like degree in this field. I just, you know, for me, I've always loved fitness and you don't need to love fitness. I have plenty of coaches that are like, I do it because I have to. I don't love it. I like it once I'm into it, but I don't love it. So you don't have to be a fitness nut. You don't have to be a nutrition guru because the cool part of this job is you talk to people about your journey, right? Your story. And then you invite them. And when they say yes, you're like, Hey, Beachbody has great products. This is what I'm doing. Um, and then this is the meal plan that I'm doing. You should totally do this with me. And so you don't have to be like, here's a meal plan. Here's this, here's that, because our company provides all of that. So that's why you don't need a degree. You don't need to know, have all this knowledge and fitness and nutrition. Um, you just need to be a cheerleader. Like if you can say you go girl, like you can be a coach really. I tell people anybody can be a coach. Jessica knows my team knows I'm such a scatterbrain. I'm such like, honestly, I was five minutes late to this presentation. <laughs> Like, I promise if I can do this, anybody can. I was voted, fun fact, I was voted most confused my senior class. Um, and that's what my entire senior class thought of me. So honestly, if anybody can build this into a successful, if I can build this into a successful business, you can. So um, what we do as coaches, in a nutshell, I was just talking to Jessica and Nicole and some of the other, and Justin Liz earlier, and I was saying how 
I really love now that I have some little time because I've got the newborn that, you know, constantly you're on their schedule now. I am being really like digging in and being really mindful with where my time is. So if I only, yeah, baby's asleep, maybe I have 30 minutes, maybe I have an hour, who knows, right? You never know what they're going to do. Um, what am I going to do? Okay. I'm going to check in with my challengers and I'm going to let them know what workout I did that day. I'm going to talk about some, um, meals that I made and, and you know, what I had for lunch maybe. And then I'm going to, you know, give some tips like, Hey, this is a really easy recipe. I tried from Pinterest yesterday. Here you go. You don't have to make these like elaborate things. Like literally you can go on Pinterest, you can go on 21 day fix or, you know, our Beachbody blog and find things and add super awesome value without having to do anything, um, incredible, you know, on your own. You're really just like showing up, encouraging them. And it, I can't expect my calendars to check in if I'm not checking in, if I'm not being that person that's like, Hey, I got it done today. So even though I can't work out right now, I've been trying to still check in and show what I'm eating and talk about, you know, how I'm doing and things like that. So we check in with our challengers, our clients. Um, we also talk about the opportunity and our team as a whole does things like these, these coach webinars. So maybe you decide to coach and then you're like, hey, I have a girl that would be awesome at it, but no way in heck would you wanna host a webinar like I'm doing right now right off the bat, right? That's scary. You're like, I don't even know what a coach does. I just signed up, I won't know. We do this for you so that you can invite your prospects. You don't have to feel like you have to do everything at once. We very much are a team. Um, you know, we've got a bunch of leaders on our team. They're constantly running, you know, things that we invite our people to. It's just a big community. It really is awesome. Um, challenge groups that we run, you don't have to start a, a new one and do your own. Like, you know, I tell my coaches until you're ready, um, to pair up with another coach and, you know, stick in ours and, and just add your people there and have fun. So it's not something that you have to like take a bunch of stuff onto your plate. Cause we're all busy and I get that. And I don't want you to feel like, okay, I started this new business. Now I need to do this and you do that and you do that. We let you like dip your toes in, um, and slowly take on more responsibility for your business. But, um, Basically, in the beginning, the first couple of months, you're going to be like an intern and you're going to be helping out with those challenge groups before you do your own. So that's one thing that I that I, I do um, kind of encourage you is to just not also feel like you need to know everything right away. Jessica will tell you <laughs> there's a lot to learn, but you don't need to like know it all the first week. That is physically impossible. There's so much stuff. I have been a coach almost seven years and I am still learning every day. Um, I totally squirreled and I don't think I even finished my story. Anyways, long story short, I was able to quit all of my jobs and now I work from home. I've got two beautiful little girls and I um, have been able to build this to a six figure income. I do not say that and say, Hey, I promise you, you're going to make a six figure income with this because I can't, I can't do that. And honestly, I, Beachbody doesn't guarantee any level of success because you have to work your butt off. Um, but it depends on how you want to work this business. Um, if you want to build a successful business, quit your job, you know, do this, then you're going to work your business a little differently than if you just want to get 25% off all your, dis you know, discount on all your products and, you know, get your Shakeology paid for it. Those are, there's two different, you know, types of coaches. And there's a third one where you're really just doing it for the discount, not talking about it, you know, doing anything there. It's totally up to you. So we call it like a discount coach, a hobby coach, or like a work, you know, like a, a working coach. Um, and at one point or another, it may change. My sisters joined me as a coach, for, as a discount coach. She had 110 pounds um, that she was going to go on to lose with Beachbody, but she just joined for the discount. So she asked for it for her birthday from her, my mom and her mother-in-law, and they went together and they bought her her challenge pack, which is the, the workouts, the meal plan, and the Shakeology. And so then she decided like, okay, this is awesome. Like I can get paid to get people to do this that I've had great results from. And my sister has been a coach for with me for five years, has been able to quit her job, is a stay-at-home mom. And, you know, I don't say this to say like, hey, join me, you'll be able to quit your job. We, you know, um, you do have to work for it, but it's just really opened up so many doors. So we have so many people that have been able to come home with their babies. Um, you know, I have one coach that um, is a military spouse, has two little girls and was able to pay for her family all with her beach body income to go to Disney. And this was just so huge for her. She made a post today, was so excited to celebrate her. Michael, if anybody um, watching is one of Michael's um, 
friends, but you know, she was able to um, do this for her family. And it's just so huge when you think about it is it's not just a job. It's something that gives you a sense of purpose. It gives you fulfillment. I get messages from people that are like, April, thank you for that. Because I also post about things that are on my heart. I've struggled with eating disorders in the past. I've struggled with self-confidence issues. You know, when I talk about it, I share little like blibs of my story here and there. And I, if I'm really struggling with something, like maybe I'm really comparing myself. I'm three weeks postpartum. I feel great. But at the same time, there's some days where I'm like, dang, I wish I could look like that. And then I have to remind myself, Comparison is the thief of joy. You just had a baby. Stop being so hard on yourself. So if I'm out having that moment, I will make a post, not just for my followers, but for me too, because I need that reminder that comparison is the thief of joy. And I'll, t I'll talk about that. And then I get messages like, April, thank you. I needed to read that so much today. And it's like, that was just as much for me as it was for you, but I'm glad it could help. So it, personal development is something else that we do. And we, whether it's reading or listening, like today, my personal development, I listen to Rachel Hollis. Has anybody ever heard of Rachel Hollis? I love Rachel Hollis. She's, if you haven't, go follow her Facebook, Instagram, whatever. I was listening to her YouTube today. And I listened to like three of her like short 10 to 15 minute videos. And I just felt so lit up and inspired. And I did this while I was nursing the baby because I, it's, I can't really read or do anything like it, you know, I, we just had a tongue lip tie procedure and, you know, nursing isn't super, <laughs> super great. I kind of still have to use two hands to, um, you know, get things done. So that was perfect for me. It was, you know, I got 35 minutes of honest, good, positive personal development. Um, and I felt so much better after, and this is something you can do, you know, audible books you could do while you're driving, while you're doing laundry, while you're making dinner. It's not like, okay, girl, you want me to send messages? You want me to do this? You want me to listen to personal development? Where am I going to find the time? There's little pockets of your day that you can make that happen. Um, so we encourage people, we work on ourselves. We don't take ourselves too seriously. And we really just kind of, you know, you post and, and try to, leave somebody better than when they first met you. Um, you know, so what can, value can I add? And there's not every day where it's like a super valuable post. There's some days where I'm making a post of a meme about hot mess mom or target or wine or Jesus, you know, who knows? There's a lot of different things that are a part of me that I may be talking about. It's not every day is, or, you know, or, Hey, here my, here's my babies, you know? <laughs> so it's not every day, but, um, we also are using, you know, our stories a lot of, for me, I do a lot more selling in my stories. Um, than I do in my posts. It's like, hey, do you want to join me? Here's this information in my stories. Um, so, which is nice because you, the people follow me for my posts, for me, what, for, you know, my target market follows me for being a hot mess mom, loving target, loving wine, um, being a scatterbrain, loving fashion, um, you know, things like that. But then in my stories, I get to be real. I get to, you know, um, kind of talk to them about what's coming up, what's this and what's that. Um, so if you're worried about like, oh, I don't want to, I don't want to come across as salesy. We don't want you to come across as salesy either. And we're going to teach you. We have a, um, a mentor, a coach mentorship that we're going to teach you how to talk to people, how to invite people, what to do when they say they want more information and then how to get them to join us. Um, so you'll know exactly what to do from start to finish of a conversation. You do not have to figure that all on your own. Um, and we'll, we'll help you with that. So um, how we earn money then is, Think about it is like if you would go and you know how think about inviting somebody is like if whoever your favorite singer is Taylor Swift comes to town and you're so excited because she's you know there's a Taylor Swift concert is there and your friends and you love Taylor Swift whatever um <laughs> then you're like oh my gosh she's coming to town you have to grab your ticket you have to join me let's do this together that is exactly how I want you to think about inviting people to join you. Because if you did that, people wouldn't be like, oh my gosh, what does Catherine want to sell me now? Like, you just be like, I want to do this. Catherine loves it. Let's go together. Let's have fun. The same thing is like, if you go to an awesome restaurant, food was great. The atmosphere was awesome. And you share it with somebody. They're not going to be like, what's in this for Debbie? <laughs> you know, <laughs> they're going to be like, Debbie wants me to come to this bomb restaurant. So when you picture it like that, and you just start asking somebody for accountability buddies, it feels so much easier than like, Hey, do you want to buy my stuff? <laughs> so we'll teach you all of that once you get started. But that's what I tell my new coaches is like, just talk to people because I know that you can think of at least 10 people right away that want to lose five, maybe five to 10 pounds or more, but five pounds, that's everybody, you know, <laughs> that wants to feel better about themselves that could use a little accountability. 
that is literally everybody you know, okay? So you don't tell me you can't think of 10 people. So then we teach you how to talk to those 10 people and just catch up with them, be a good friend. Like, what are they doing? What are they up to? Do they go on vacation? What they have planned for the next couple of weeks? What's going on? Then at the end of the conversation is when you're like, hey, I don't know if you've seen, but I started this new workout and I'm loving it and I'm really looking for more accountability buddies. What are you currently doing for your workouts these days? Did that sound salesy? No, we teach you exactly how to be a good friend, to be genuine, and to just invite people along the way. I get a ton of people that will tell me like, you know, April, I swear, I tell, I tell people to follow you all the time because you are like selling without even sounding like you're selling and I don't know how you do it, but you make me wanna be a part of it. And that is what I want to teach you guys too, is to like invite people without them feeling like they're being invited, just having a good time. Um, okay, so how we earn, we make 25 to 40% in, um, commission off everything we sell, sell, <clears throat> can't talk. <laughs> um, and so when you are, you know, getting somebody signed up with, Hey, here's a couple different options. Here's the package I started with. This is everything you need that I personally use. Um, you're going to get them signed up, send them the link to, to sign up, they purchase, and then you make. 25% of that. If they just buy Beachbody on demand by itself, that's 40% commission. Um, then there's a couple other ways. I'm not going to go into depth because like I said, we're keeping this to short and sweet. There's a team cycle bonus. There's um, uh, star diamond bonuses. There's a um, fast starter bonus. And once you join, we will talk more about it. But basically you can make money. Um, in passive income by continuously building your team, inviting people, and just showing up every day and rocking your business. So there's lots of other ways. So for me, most of my paycheck comes from my team cycle bonus, which is because I've built a team over the years um, and I make a great income based off of my team's success. So that's why else it's another great thing is that's why we do these webinars because we want you guys to have coaches join so that you can see that success so that you can build that income. And then if you guys aren't successful, then your, your upline isn't successful. So the more coaches that we can help, the better. And so that's why we do so, so much stuff like this and helping you and helping you train your coaches so that we can all be successful. Um, and then um, how to get started. So how you would get started is, so let me use Catherine for an example. Catherine is an existing customer. She has Shakeology. She has um, Beachbody On Demand. Um, so there's a couple different options for the Catherines <laughs> that you can either. So maybe you have Shakeology, but you've never tried the performance line, which is our energized which is our, um, oh, Catherine, you did sign up. Okay, well, I'm just using you as an example. Um, so, um, so, so say you're, you know, you aren't signed up as a coach yet, but you're like, how, what's the best way for me to get started? Cause I already have this. Well, maybe you have Shakeology, but you've never tried Energize and Recover. That's our plant-based pre-workout and our post-workout. Um, and so you could do, or my unicorn juice is what I love to call it. So you could do those together plus like access to bar or those together plus a three, three day refresh or something like that, that you do a three day cleanse that you don't have. Um, for, I think that if you already have like Beachbody on demand, there's a plenty of options that are anywhere from like one thirty to $200. And then if you don't have anything, then we, your coach will help you talk to you about, um, okay, you need Beachbody on demand. You were, would you rather have Shakeology or the Energize and Recover? And there's a bunch of different options. Everything with the bar blend workout is on sale this month. And we have $10 off promo codes to give to people too. So there's a lot of great options for you. Plus anybody this month while supplies last that purchases a challenge pack, it's a free box of pumpkin spice, which is so cool. Like it's a $75 box of pumpkin spice and pumpkin spice shakeology is so freaking good. It's really good. So a bunch of really great ways. Now the uh, last option of how to get started is you could just pay $40 and sign up as a coach. If you've bought a challenge back in the last 30 days, that $40 fee would be refunded as well. The only thing is, is if you don't have Beachbody On Demand, you don't have Shakeology, you don't have anything, you are basically just throwing that $40 down the drain because you can't be, you can't be a successful coach if you're not being a product of the product. So I would rather, if you don't have anything and you're like, $40, cool, I can sign up. I would rather you pay $40 for three months access of Beachbody On Demand, start working out so that you can, you know, have some, you know, workouts at least to show and then sign up as a coach. 
the next time you have $40 or something like that. So we want you to make sure that you're being a product of the product. We don't want you to just sign up. We want you to love it, um, love the products. We want you to just, you know, this needs to be something that you're passionate about. I could not go and sell um, jewelry. I couldn't do it. Like there's plenty of network marketing companies that do that. I love jewelry, but I, I couldn't do it. Like I, I'm not passionate about it. So I'd be like, okay, well, I have to talk to people. I have to do this. I have to do that. But this is something that I've changed into my life that is a part of me every day. And I'm absolutely love it. So I, you know, I want to tell people, Hey, you should do this with me. Hey, come if they're local. Hey, come work out with me. Hey, I'll make you a shake after. And I get a lot of local people that way. Um, by just saying, Hey, let's do a workout together. Then I make them a shake or I give them some energize or something. And they're hooked after that because it's great. Um, so, you know, think about, don't just think about social media. We use social media a ton, but there's plenty of people like that are probably local to you that you could be like, Hey, come on over. Let's do a workout together. Um, fun things like that. So, um, that's basically it. The other perks of coaching are I, we, we host a diamond retreat. So diamond is a rank, um, that you, you will reach in your business once you're rocking your business. And we do retreats where we, it's a, you know, all inclusive, everything paid you paid to get there. That's it. Um, we pay for, we, this past year I took my, um, diamonds to, Utah. Um, we have a corporate office out there. We went hiking. We did a professional photo shoot. It was this beautiful cabin. I had surprised them with a choreographer to come and she taught us um, a dance to um, The Greatest Showman. We had so much fun. It was just such a great time. And just, you know, we did some business, but we also just like, it was like a sisterhood, you know, it was just really great people. Every year we do our um, yearly conference. It's called Coach Summit. Jessica, did you buy your ticket today? Yay! She's gonna buy it tonight. Um, and so this year it is July and it's in New Orleans, which means it's gonna be really hot. But it's gonna, it was it was there one year before, it was like a couple of years ago. Um, the food is great, but it's gonna be hot. And so all of the super trainers, celebrity trainers are there. You work out with them live. You get to hear about new upcoming things that are being launched. You get to take pictures with the trainers. You get to buy fun swag, um, just such good training from top coaches in our company. So you can also earn that. And as your beginning few months as a coach, you can earn a free ticket to summit and you can also earn a, your, um, spot in a pot the pilot test group for the next program to be launched. So 10 rounds is going to be launched. And if you earned your success starters, you could be in the pilot test group, which means you could try it before it even launches to, um, the network, which is really cool. So let me now go through, I want to make sure that everybody is on here has posted who you are um, and who invited you. Um, da, 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 da. Okay. Alicia, remind me your last name. I'm having a, a mind fart. Okay. Um, so Jennifer, Alicia. Okay. Sorry. I forgot I was being recorded. So I should do this later. Um, okay. Is there any questions in here? Okay, so basically, does anybody have anything that I didn't cover or anything? Oh, cop. Okay, thank you, Alicia. Um, does anybody have any questions about anything I didn't cover? Or does anybody want to talk about reasons why you're nervous to coach? Because you can feel free to post those in there. Um, Jessica, um, what was your biggest hesitation before you signed up as a coach? I had two. Um, that were pretty equal um, time. For those of you that, guys that don't know me, um, I'm currently a stay-at-home mom. I'm a registered nurse, but I stay at home and I've got two toddlers um, and I'm with them all the time. And I just thought, I mean, how do I work a business when I'm caring for two kids all day? And I have found um, in the mom cracks of my day that I can do it. Um, you know, some days I get up before the kids um, sometimes it's during nap time. Sometimes it's 10 minutes while I'm waiting, you know, at the doctor's office or something. I mean, you can do it. You can make the time for it. It doesn't take hours and hours and hours. Mm -hmm. Um, and the other thing was I thought that I had to be like super in shape. I had to have a six pack abs and you don't, um, I was well on my way in my journey since I had became a challenger before a coach. Um, so I had made a ton of progress, but once I actually joined and became a coach, 
just having that accountability. I mean, I got results like crazy. So it was amazing. So those are my two biggest hangups, I think. Okay. Thanks. I love that. Yeah. And, and like I said, my, my Melissa, my sister, she joined, she signed up as a coach and then lost 110 pounds. So like literally like Jessica's down 30 pounds. She's like smaller than she was before she got married. She's doing awesome. Um, you know, I lost 50 pounds with my first pregnancy. I gained 40 pounds this pregnancy. Um, so I know that I'll be able to do it again because it works. And I, and I, it's something that's so easy. Um, the workouts, the meal plan, everything fits into your day. And then this coaching is like, it's a no brainer. If you love doing this, why not just talk about it? So Jennifer said, um, she's heard people say something like, Oh, that girl's just trying to sell MLM crap. And she's nervous to put herself out there, but I love watching you every day. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so here's the thing. The people that are like MLM haters, they're not going to join you. They're probably not going to join you. They're probably so just stuck in their ways that they, they may turn their nose up at you. And that's okay because you're not joining for them. You're joining for the person like you that wants to feel a little better in their skin, that would love to have something for them to, to have, you know, be able to have a little bit more time freedom, to be able to make a little bit more income, to take away from some of the stress and anxiety that they have and have something that they feel like is theirs to give them a sense of purpose. So you're looking for the other Jennifers out there, not somebody that's so quick to judge another mom that's trying to make an income for, to provide for her family. If like people like that, that are judgy, like, okay, good, cool. But you're not my tribe because I'm doing this for me. I'm doing this to better my life. I'm doing this to encourage other people. And I'm not doing this so that I can please you because other people's opinion of you do not pay your bills. And that's the biggest thing that I can tell you is that there's going to, my own sister, like not the sister that joined, but the other sister she blocked, not blocked, but she like hid both my sisters and I's posts because she said that we were annoying. Like, okay, I'm not doing this business for you. I'm doing this for the people that want to feel better about themselves. Um, and you just have to separate yourself from the outcome because not everybody's going to say yes. People are going to say no. And people are also just not going to say anything, but it doesn't automatically mean that they're sitting there like, Ugh, this girl and her MLM, I'm going to ignore her just so she can like take that. Like they probably opened the, the message while they were trying to make dinner and their toddlers are climbing all over. And then, you know, oops, there's somebody at the door, like, and they forgot to respond. <laughs> so nine times out of 10, it's just that somebody got busy because everybody's busy. Um, and so just not being like emotionally connected to the outcome, um, because I've invited so many people so many times. I have people that come back a year later, weeks later, months later, I had somebody join. They're like, I've been following you for five years now. <laughs> like, wow, that's amazing. I'm so excited you're finally ready. So just know that you're doing this for you. And as long as your why is right and you're doing this to have fun and encourage other people, who cares about the naysayers? Because they're going to be rolling your, their eyes at you no matter what you're doing. You might as well do something that brings you joy and that provides another income for your family. So that's that. <laughs> um, okay. I'm going to stop the